I've had my COVID vaccination. I've had my COVID vaccination. So unfair. It's 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 so un it's so un Who? Look, these things happen. <sighs> I don't mind. I don't, it, I don't mind, except it's a Friday and I, I have plans. I was going to go to a spin class tomorrow. Those spots are really hard to get. Okay. And I, and I got one and now I can't go. I've just had to cancel it. Thank God I cancelled within the cancellation window and I can get my credit back. Thank God. If not, I would be charging it to the NHS. More importantly, okay, I run out of oat milk. What am I supposed to do without my oat milk latte? You know, I've also run out of hummus. How do I know that the Deliveroo person isn't just gonna pick the closest one to the edge of the shelf that's going to go off today. You need to go to the back and get the one that's going off in a week. Do they know that? <laughs> it's fine. It's fine. No, I'm kidding. In all seriousness, I um, do have to start by something. I have run out of oat milk and I am traversing the muddy waters of ordering on Deliveroo, which is something that I literally never do. Don't believe in Deliveroo. Why? Don't know. I do have plans this week and I've cancelled them all. I was going to go to a pottery cafe. It was going to be a delightful time. That said, I'm being responsible, which means I'm going to stay in my house for five days. I'm going to do the yoga. No, I don't. Um, maybe I'll do extra yoga. Maybe I, maybe I should do that tomorrow to make up for the loss of the spin class. I'm not allowed to go for a run. I'm not allowed to go out, out and about at all. I know that we've been doing this for over a year, but it's blowing my mind. All of my friends are going on a camping trip. I wasn't going, but now I won't be doing anything else. What's the like going to be like this weekend? Cool. At least I'm not camping. It's so it's so fun because you know having been through a bit of a, a slump um, in May, June has been a really great month for me, and I'm sure I'm sure that the reason why I've been having a good time and feeling energized and motivated and happy is because I've been having really good weekends. I've been having a really great time and that has been really improving my mental health. So this comes at a perfect time, this re-isolation. You know, I live alone. So that's great. That's great. Um, that's great. Nothing to eat for lunch. Oh, I'm starving now. My Waitrose delivery has arrived. I ordered it from Waitrose because I was feeling depressed. Let's be bougie. Let's order some groceries from Waitrose. I ordered it at 25 past 11. It is now quarter to 12. It's been 20 minutes since I placed this order and it's arrived at my house. How, how is, how? Look at this bag of deliciousness. Bread, no this, because I'm cheap. Free range eggs, obvi. Coffee, hummus. When does it go off? The 29th! 10 out of 10. I treated myself. Strawberries. Blueberries. My favourite. Fizzy water. You can't tell me that I don't know how to live. I'm kind of blown away with milk, which is... I mean, is it too late to have an oat milk latte? It is before 12. I normally don't drink coffee past 12. I don't feel like I need one. Maybe I'll have a tea. This has been an all-around excellent experience. I, I can't believe how... This is quicker than me going to the shop. This is quicker than me walking to the Tesco three minutes from my house, buying stuff and coming back. This is very dangerous. Well, I'm, I'm happy now because I can have lunch. And I can have an oatmeal latte. 
This is really cheered me up. Thanks, Deliveroo. So I've decided to take a quick break and tidy my room, a very, uh, very important part of any self-isolation uh, time, is to make sure your space is nice. Nice space. So my space is a mess. All of my spaces are messes. This is a mess. I'm a mess. I live in a mess. I don't even, I don't even notice I live in a pigsty. Um, I'll show you the mess. Here's some footage of the mess. I've got half an hour before my next meeting. Um, I need to calm down. So time to do a bit of cleaning. It is much later. Friday night in with me, myself, and isolation. Are you ready to see my clean room? Oh my god! Ba da ba, ba da ba da ba da ba da ba. Oh, that's a bit messy. Mess. Ba da ba 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 ba. Um, oh Jesus. Uh, happy that that's done. Shame about all the other rooms in the house, not gonna lie. I'm gonna watch a film with my friend tonight. We're gonna FaceTime and watch a film at the same time, which we haven't done since lockdown, but it's nice that she wants to do it with me again. Revitalizing our lockdown activities for my benefit. And I'm so appreciative. Salop. Putting my trainers on. Um, I was going to do like an on-demand class with my gym, um, but then it said it needed weights, and I don't have weights, and I panicked, and I've never done one of their classes before, so I was getting really stressed out, and I didn't have time to do yoga, so I was like, oh my god, I'm freaking out. Oh my god. I was like, this isn't the vibe. This isn't the chill vibe that we want. So um, instead, 30-minute hot girl summer sculpt. She says you need weights. I've got two cans of coconut milk, okay? 400 mil, but let's imagine it's 10 kilos. Sweat. Day two, we're feeling ah, positive. We're trying new things. We're gonna work out. Work out. That was pretty intense, which I am embarrassed by. I think I consider myself a relatively fit person, but I think I'm fit uh, in my specific disciplines, which is, um, you know, rocket yoga and spin class. Maybe I should just try and do like something like that every day. This is a weird angle. It's time to go. It is a good few hours later. Um, as you can see, I've been working hard in the yard. I've done an amazing job. In that time, my Sainsbury's order arrived, which is very exciting, and my ASOS order has arrived. So I'm very excited. I'm gonna go have a quick cleanse 
and then we can go do a fashion show. This is what fashion looks like. Fashion. Okay, refreshed from my shower. I've been Wim Hoffing recently, so I'm well into a cold shower at the moment. My dirty ASOS package is here. Dirty is in the filth of fast fashion. They're summer tops. A little blue croppy number. We have another little crop. She's a top shop. I'm trying to embrace color this summer. Most of my clothes are black. <laughs> woolen look, not woolen feel. Um, I don't really know how I feel about this one. I can't really see. This was the most expensive one. Well, the rest of my day was super chilled after my yoga and then my pop Pilates hot girl summer workout and then my two hours of digging up weeds in the garden and then my hour of mowing lawn. I was kind of tired. Um, so yeah, after my fashion show, wearing my new t-shirt, I decided to lie down on the sofa for Sometime. read my book just making some dinner and i'm gonna watch jaws which is on my list of movies to watch this weekend so <laughs> i've never seen it and i'm afraid <sighs> but anyway time for some delicious lentil curry These wisps just will not quit. I'm nervous. I'm about to log in for a 75 minute flow class. Live in one minute, oh my God. my yoga class I genuinely had a really great time it was a really nice experience because they play music through the app I loved that she had great music taste she had all the yoga songs that were on my personal yoga playlist plus more so that was absolutely delightful did things like the back bends on the floor we did a lot of bridge we did camel back bends are genuinely the thing I dislike the most about yoga uh, I find them really challenging physically emotionally I do not enjoy pushing myself into back bends because it feels very sketchy it's good to challenge myself i really i really i really don't know what to do about this hair to play just for a bit of cultural juice. Suck the honey of his music does. Now see that noble 
the most sovereign reason life. Life. Sweet bells jangled out of tune and harsh. So we've come to the end of day three. Oh, sorry, what a day it's been. What words can I use to describe it? Long, alone, raining. I, things I have achieved today, okay? Things I've achieved, laundry. <laughs> Not to be snuffed up, <laughs> okay, <laughs> okay. I watched a play, I watched Hamlet for the first time. Jesus. Good play. Bloody good play. I don't know if anyone's ever said this, but I think Hamlet's a really good play. What else have I done? I spoke to my mum. I spoke to my dad separately just to eke it out a little bit. Um, I sat in the garden and started reading my book and I was like, I'm finally doing it. I'm sitting in the garden reading my book and then it started raining. Then I decided to watch Parasite. Spoiler alert is a movie where on an evening when it's pissing with rain, uh, a man reveals that he's living in a basement and murder ensues. And, um, I live alone, it's pissing with rain, and I have a basement. I've locked it, I've double locked it. The rain just won't quit, and neither will my imagination. Even when I was watching it, I was like, I don't think this is that scary. This isn't that scary. And it absolutely was scary. I'm thinking about it now. I'm thinking about those people living in the basement. <sighs> just felt like the film was happening to me, despite the fact that I do not live in South Korea. Okay, I'm freaking myself out. I'm freaking myself out. Time for bed. Three down, two to go. Okay, here is the tea. Day three tea. Day four tea. Not 40, dear God. D day four tea. I feel depressed. I hate being inside. I hate it. I've just went and stood in my garden for 10 minutes thinking about how depressed I am. And it did actually help. Recommend that. So yes, I have spent the majority of today, day four, feeling a bit down because all of my friends had a really great weekend across the board. Um, and I have been in my house on my own for the weekend. So fun. I'm doing a lot of work today. Um, that's kind of it. I did do my yoga this morning. Um, I'm going to do a workout in a bit. I'm going to do one. Normally I would do a spin class at 6 p.m. on a Monday. I can't do that today and that's hard, <laughs> which sounds so dramatic. If I've spent the whole weekend on my own at home, I find Mondays very difficult. <laughs> They're quite, quite depressing. One thing that really helps me with that is going to spin class on a Monday evening, a good start to the week, and the rest of the week is kind of an uphill from there. Really feeling the, the absence of that reassurance of a future spin in my brain today. Uh, but I've got my new weights and I've got my iPad, which has Dig Me At Home on it. So I'm gonna choose a class I've never done before. Doing new things cheers me up. Hopefully that will make me feel better. Penultimate day of isolation. It's not gonna beat me. I'm
I did my workout. Um, it was a strength workout and I've never done anything like that before. So I don't know how hard it's supposed to be. I am glistening. I have a glow. I do feel less depressed. Um, exercise is good for that. One of these days I am going to have to get a handle on my hair. Why does it look like this? Okay. Calm, calm. Is this, let's, ow. Low bun. I feel like, <laughs> this even works. It's better than it was before. I don't think so. It's the last day today. One day more. I'm excited. I am hungry. It's lunchtime. I have got nothing to say. I'm excited. It's the stress of isolation. It's the final day today. I'm so excited. I can't wait. I did yoga with Adrian this morning. I've been doing a bit of work this morning. I am considering doing another workout because I don't feel very sore. Oh, let me just check the, the butt. Yeah, you know, my legs and hips and stuff aren't, they're not great. They're not amazing. Um, so anyway, it, I'm not super sore, so I am considering doing another workout today because that really cheered me up yesterday. So that's on the cards. It'll probably be a similar thing. Gonna get through the day. The time has come for another workout. Pissing with rain today, which is very demotivational. This is a live workout and I've never done one of those before. So I don't know if it's a cameras on, camera off situation. So I think I'm gonna go with camera off to start with. I'm wearing the same outfit as yesterday. Is that gross? Much later, I did the workout, the strength workout, uh, live with the Jig Me at home. And it was much harder than the workout yesterday. But it still didn't feel like I was maxing out. Like it didn't feel like hit classes, you go, 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 go. But she did say this isn't a hit class, we're not, it's not supposed to feel like that. But I do, I do feel quite sore, like my muscles feel tired now. So that's good. Um, bleh, 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 bleh. Time couldn't go any slower if it tried on this very last day of self-isolation. I want it to be bedtime because I want to wake up tomorrow. It's like Christmas morning. It's like Christmas morning. I want to wake up tomorrow, bound downstairs, smash through my lemon water and my coffee, pop my leggings on and pop on over to spin. I'm also excited to walk to spin because I haven't done more than like two or 3000 steps for these past five days. Not walking has been something that I've been trying not to think about. I can't tell you how many times I thought to myself, oh, I'll just go for a quick walk. Sat at my desk all day. My brain is like, I want to go outside and smell the river and the other things. I want to go outside and get some fresh air and like stretch my legs. And I'm so grateful that I've only had to isolate for five days. I don't, obviously I could 100% do 10 days. <clears throat> Whoa, I could 100% do 10 days. 10 days completely on my own would be quite tough. Really pleased. I'm really pleased it was just five days. I just want to go for a walk. I just want to pop to, pop to the shops. Pop, 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 pop to the shops. Yeah. Okay, stop, stop. High School Musical throwback, anyone? I'm really excited about walking to the spin studio, doing the spin, and then walking back. 
and then maybe I'll go for another walk at some point. Oh my god. Just, you know, maybe I'll just like wander around aimlessly in the outside world. Shut up, Alice. Nobody cares. Does anybody care? No.